guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new then welcome today in this video I am going to be talking about my skincare routine and everything that I do to make sure that my skin doesn't have any acne blemishes and make sure that my pores are all good I will be talking about what I use for my face and my body before I do get started though I am going to mention that all throughout high school I didn't have any trouble with acne I would get some here and there but it wasn't super bad to the point where I really needed to see a doctor about it um, I also am allergic to a lot of antibiotics, which is kind of why I decided to use the body wash that I use now. So I will dive all into that right now. So the first face wash that I use in the shower is the St. Ives brand. I have been loving their face wash. I feel like it's super natural and it's really nice for your skin. It is the St. Ives Acne Control. It is oil-free, salicylic acid acne medication. And I love that it's oil-free because anything that has oil I don't want to put on my face since my face is already so oily but it is an apricot scrub so it's apricot scented and it prevents acne and evens your skin tone which I love I always want to have a nice even skin tone so I'm always looking for products that do that for me and so since this is a scrub it has lots of cleansing beads in it so on the back of the packaging it does talk about the exfoliation factor because each of their face washes do have a certain degree of exfoliation to it. This one is deep so it is very exfoliating to the face but I do love that for controlling my acne and making sure that I am blemish free. This is what the packaging looks like. The next product that I use in the shower for my face is also a St. Ives brand. It is for blackhead clearing. It is also an oil free salicylic acid acne medication and it is a green tea scrub which is green tea scented and it clears blackheads and unclogs pores. I really like this because I do get lots of blackheads on my nose, so I will really concentrate this in my T-zone and my nose. This exfoliation factor is moderate, so it does have some exfoliating beads in it, but not nearly as much as apricot scrub, but I do love this for giving my face a nice wash for my blackheads. And that is the packaging for this one. The next one I do for my face, I wash my face all the time, so I always have three steps usually to wash my face, and it is the St. Ives Radiant Skin. It is pink and lemon mandarin orange scented, and it also is a scrub. It polishes away your dullness for radiant skin. This face wash, I love it because it really does make your skin baby smooth soft. The very first time that I used this, I got out of the shower and I felt my face and it literally was so smooth that I can't imagine doing my face wash routine without adding this at the end. I do do this in a step process, so I do the acne control first, then the blackhead clearing, and then I do this radiant skin one at the end just to make sure everything is nice and smooth instead of doing my exfoliation after. The exfoliation factor for this one is moderate, so it still does have some beads in it, but like I said, not nearly as much as the apricot scrub as well. This is the packaging for this one. Okay, next I'm gonna talk about what I do for my body in the shower. I am allergic to a lot of antibiotics, so I always have to be careful from breaking out if I get sick and what kind of medications they give me. It used to be really bad in high school since that's when I kind of discovered that I was allergic to antibiotics. So I started using the brand, it's called Panoxyl. Is an acne foaming wash and it has benzoyl peroxide in it. It does have certain degrees of strength to it and I do get the 10% which is the maximum strength. The things that this face wash does for your body is it clears existing acne blemishes and helps prevent new blemishes from forming. It is formulated to be gentle on the skin. It does contain the benzoyl peroxide which is an antibacterial ingredient. It is for your face, chest, and back. I absolutely love this stuff. It gets rid of my acne if I ever break out on my chest and my back, which is the main points that I actually do break out, if ever. So I always have to be careful of what products I use on my body. My body is very sensitive to the things I put on it. This is why I don't use products such as Bath & Body Works. I feel like they put a lot of different scents and a lot of different ingredients that just aren't actually good for your skin so I always try to be the natural route. This is the packaging for the Panoxyl. The next product that I am going to be talking about today is my moisturizer for my face. So even though I do have oily skin I always like to make sure that my skin is hydrated especially now that it is winter I do get drier skin but 
to a certain extent. So I always have to be careful of when I am using my moisturizer. I usually will do it after a shower at night or during the morning after a shower if I have nothing going on that day. Otherwise, if I do apply moisturizer in the morning, my face will just get 10 times more oily throughout the day. But the moisturizer that I do use is the IT Cosmetics Confidence in a Cream. And this is actually an anti-aging serum. But I mean, you can never, it can never be too early to prevent those fine lines and wrinkles. It is a transforming moisturizing super cream and it is for all skin types, which I love. I got mine at Ulta and I absolutely love this. You get actually so much in this container and this has honestly lasted me close to a year probably. And I know you guys are probably gonna be like, okay, you never use it, but honestly I do because you don't need that much because this moisturizer a little goes a long ways. And yeah, I just love it. Next, I am gonna talk about Juice Beauty. That is the brand. It is an organic solution blemish clearing serum. It helps with your blemishes if you ever get any. All the ingredients in this too are organic. Now, as you can see, I got this the same time that I got my moisturizer, and I don't use it as often just because since it is organic, it has like a smell to it, and my boyfriend will literally, he can tell when I put it on. Like, I won't even tell him that I put this stuff on, and last year he'd always be like, you have that stuff on, don't you? And I'd be like, yeah. <laughs> so I was always self-conscious of the smell of it, and I mean, yeah, it smells, but I feel like it works. I mean, it does the job, so I always try to do this at night even though it's not the best time to do it since it smells, but like whatever, it it works since it's organic, it's gonna have a different scent because they don't put any non-natural scents in it because otherwise it's obviously not organic. So I would recommend it though because it does work wonders on your skin and it really does clear any blemish that you get throughout the day. So the next product I am gonna talk about is actually oil preventing and oil helping. So it is Pacifica, it's a pineapple flower, oil-free matte mist. It's supposed to slay oil and it's made with pineapple and hyaluronic acid. It's for oily and combination skin types, it is 100% vegan and it is cruelty free. I got this at Target and it actually really does work. if. It's morning and I'm just going to be doing a no makeup day. I will spray this on my face or even just on a normal day. If I'm Even if I'm doing makeup, I will spray this all over my face and it really does help with any oil throughout the day. It really does keep my skin nice and fresh, which I love. Pacifica also has pineapple wipeout oil cleansing face wipes. It is also made with pineapple extract facial towelettes and it's for oily and combination skin types. I also got this at Target. It came right next to this pineapple flower mist and I love it because if you use this as makeup remover, it really does dig deep down and takes out all the oil as well that is on your face. So you can use this whether you feel oil halfway through the day and even if you don't have makeup and just wipe your face. It's just a great way to make sure that you're preventing those oils from going into your pores and creating acne. So that's why I love these wipes. The next skincare routine that I am going to talk about is the Tan Lux. It is the Face Illuminating Self Tan Drops. It is in the shade Medium Dark. This is the packaging. I have just recently started fake tanning. So I always want my face to be as dark as my body and since I do so much exfoliating on my face, my face gets way whiter than my body like by the second day and I was searching around on YouTube and I found these really nice drops that people have said really worked for them and this is the bottle it is the cutest little bottle it's kind of like the juice beauty bottle so the juice beauty is one just like this too so all you do is you take it out you pinch this and it comes in the tube and so you're supposed to mix this with your moisturizer so I would mix it with my 
It Cosmetics. You can either put it on your hand and then put the facial drops on your top of your hand and just like mix it around and then apply it. Otherwise, you can also, I've been doing this the last couple times, I put the moisturizer on my face and then I take the drops and I put it all over my face as well and then I rub it in that way. I kind of like doing that better, then I don't have to have it on my hand and then try and apply it on my face. I'd rather just put it all on my face right away and then it's there. But so far, I've really been liking it. It's just a nice little quick tan if you don't want to put any makeup on, even if you're just doing like a quick natural makeup this is a good way to do it too if you don't want to put any foundation on your face you can literally basically make it into a moisturizer and just put it on your face so I've been loving this they also have body mousses for fake tanning your body right now I have a transcuticals wand and so I kind of want to get through the rest of that self tanner and then I think I'm gonna try out the tan Lux body so if you guys would like me to do a separate tutorial on my fake tanning routine, definitely give it a thumbs up and comment below and I will definitely make a video about that. Okay guys, so that does conclude the video. And side note, look how cute this scarf is. Like, oh, and this top, like, mm, girl, please. The scarf and the shirt are brought to you by Evereve, so hit them up if you want this pretty scarf because it is amazing. Thank you guys for watching my video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching my skincare routine and all the amazing products that I use. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, comment below, subscribe, and make sure you share. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.